Greetings, this is Mikael, and I'd like to know, who do you follow, man or ya? And right now, we get ready to do part two of the seventh day. This is part two, which is um, Genesis chapter two, verse three. And this is called, it's called the seventh day part two, but this one is actually called Yah. Yah bless, I like to say bliss and sanctify the seventh day. And right now we're in Genesis chapter two, verse three. And it reads, and God, Yah blessed, I like to say bliss, the seventh day and sanctified it because that in it he had rest from all his work which God created and made. So as we see here, the Father, the Creator, Almighty Yah, he blessed and sanctified the uh the Sabbath day. Now I have a few um a few um definitions on it. And right now we have what is he what is the Hebrew meaning of sanctified? The meaning of sanctification. The term of sanctification as used in the new covenant as a little like I say hegemos, but it spells H A G I O S M O S and means basically set apart. In the sense of being set apart from all else and dedicated for Yahweh's or Yah's use. What is the root word of sanctify? The Latin root is Latin root of sanctify, uh, sanctify is sanctus, holy. Definitions of sanctify, this is an adjective, may declare or believe to be holy, devoted to a deity or some religious ceremony or use, like sanctified wine as they got here. What is the full meaning of bless? It say be less, B E L E S S, which is um to consecrate or render holy, beneficial, or prosperous by means of a religious rite, to give honor or glory to a person or thing as divine or holy. Bless, B L E S O English. Uh, let's say the meaning was influenced by its being used to translate Latin benedictor to praise, worship, and later by association with. Bliss, that's B-L-I-S-S. -S. What is the biblical meaning of bliss? Supreme happiness, utter joy, uh, supreme happiness, utter joy, uh, contentment, wedded bliss, theology, the joy of heaven, heaven, paradise, the road to eternal bliss. Thank you for your time, patience, listening near, and seeing nigh.